I apologize in advance if you hear any lawn mowing outside of my window. It's 10 a.m. on a Monday, and what they don't know is that most people are at work, but this video game in Gremlin does not work on Monday, so I'm here and I get to listen to them weed whacking, and all I wanna do is just enjoy some gin booty cheeks. Speaking of gin booty cheeks, I am excited to jump back into Ghost of Tsushima today. I really need this. But I've also been seeing a lot of really kind and also very informative comments. There's been a lot of people telling me to do like this small stuff in the game that's, but it, it but it's like cool. It's like a fun little addition. I do apologize though if I seem like I'm not very interactive in the comments. To be honest, it's because like a lot of the games that I play on my channel I have never played before. So with these being completely blind playthroughs and with the state of the internet and just people, some people like to spoil stuff. So I really tend to read my comments very carefully so that I don't get any details from the story spoiled for me, thus ruining the fun for me and then for you guys watching. But I do occasionally go and just poke through really, really fast. And then if I see something then I'm like, just, just click out of it. But just know that I have been seeing those and I will try to remember to attempt some of them today, but most importantly though, I'm just excited to jump into this beautiful world and I am ready to escape into the world of Tsushima because this is one of the most beautiful games I've ever played. So with all that being said, thank you so much for joining me. Buckle up, buttercup, we're going in. I know I didn't say my normal intro today, but I hope that my shirt gets the point across just as nicely. <laughs> all right, now back to the game. So we got to a really good part in the story. We have finally rescued Lord Shimura, and in my opinion, his reemergence into Jin's life has been so good and so powerful for the story because I think going forward, you're really gonna see Jin kind of coming to terms and grappling with his uncle's ideologies because his uncle is very much about the samurai way. The most important thing to him is honor and keeping to all of those ideologies where we have seen Jin meeting all these people in his travels and meeting all of these wonderful characters kind of teaching him a different way of looking at things and different perspectives that might stray from the samurai honor code so you're gonna see these two dichotomies in his life kind of coming together and pulling him each way and seeing him really grapple and struggling with who is he more interested in pleasing at the end of the day is it going to be his new friends his uncle or is he just going to do what he needs to do to survive and what he needs to do that's best for him so i'm sure it's gonna get so much better from here on out Lord Sakai. My thanks to you and your companions. Where do you serve? See the temple. Our warrior monks rode south to fight the Mongols after we heard about Komoda. But our journey ended here. I'm sorry. What happened? We were ambushed and taken captive, shoved into a covered pit. No food. So dark I couldn't see my hands in front of my face. I think they took Jogan out first. We heard him struggling and shouting. Then shouts turned to screams. Poor Jogan. We could smell. No, don't say it. Burning. But we refused to submit. There were only three of us left when they took my brother, Enjo. Enjo, the guardian? I'm sorry, he's gone. He was a great warrior. An even better brother. Aww. What's your name? Norio, my lord. I'm gonna cry, his poor brother. Ah! As someone who has a brother. Or kill the person with That hole barely fits six men. I promised it holds double that. Walk with me, Norio. I want to show you something. You rode from Toyotama. What was it like? Kushi Temple was spared, as were the healers of Akashima. I hear the pirate's nest of Umugi Cove still stands. Where are we walking to? Oh, do we have to leave? Should we... Look around and gain some supplies first. I don't think I'm hurting for supplies, to be honest. 
Daily fit check. Looking good. Could do without the mud, but it's fine. It's fine. Let's stop here. There must be thousands of invaders. Now that Lord Shimura is free, he can lead us to victory. I hope you join our fight. The monks of Cedar Temple can help. They're all within the day's ride. Support them, and we'll sweep the Mongols back into the ocean. We will avenge your brother, Norio. All the monks who died here. I don't seek revenge, but I will fight for peace. The Khan took me prisoner. I would end my life. No hesitation. Oh, that's bleak. Oh, yikes. That's not that's not a confidence booster, my friend. I don't know who said that. All right, talk us to my village to support our healers. If we're going to fight back, we need their skills. I can introduce you to Hochi. My brother always said he's the greatest healer of us all. Then I'll Hochi. see you again in Akashima. Oh my goodness. Legends of the Storyteller. Oh, wait. Journal update. Wait, 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 wait. Are, you're kidding me. You're kidding me. You're kidding me. My brain right now. We have so many follow-ups. My, I just got so happy from that. We have more Lady Masako. We have more Ishikawa. I'm dead serious when I say I have so looked forward to going forward and like specifically Ishikawa's tale. I really want to know what happens with him and Tomoe. I love his story, but I also love Lady Masako as a character, like as a person and like what drives her to do what she does. I feel for her and her pain and it's she is just such a compelling character and I find her story so interesting. But then we have more so this guy has norio's got multiple tails oh my gosh he, it seems like he's got two different tails going on we have a yuna tail wait wait we have two masako tails as well and then we have oh cool we still have follow-ups for kenji as well there is so much to do i wonder if it's gonna all take place in the new island or the new section of the map i think we can go back whenever we want but this is gonna be so fun Gotta go back to the Traveler's Attire, y'all. Like, we got so much more to do and explore. We gotta put this on so we can find all the things. Yo, I just saw this too. We also got the hat that was originally worn by Ryuzo, which last episode was just such a big episode. We found out that Ryuzo actually betrayed us and was going to kill us to earn the reward that was put on Jin's head by the Mongol leader. And yeah, that... That didn't surprise me after what had happened, like, with the fact that none of them were there and, like, all the stuff that they had gone through in the past and how desperate his men were, but it was still really sad to see, you know, the choice that he made, but the the points and the reasoning that he gave for why he changed sides and allegiances made sense, even though it was really sad. But do I want to wear the hat that's literally called Betrayer's Hat? It looks really cool. But then we have the Wanderer's hat, which I think goes better with this outfit, and I just love the look of it. But I really also like the Sword Master's hat. I just think these kind of hats go really nicely with this outfit. But I like this one because it's Sword Master's hat, and like, we're a Sword Master now. Not really. I still got a long way to go. But I just I like the look of this one, I think, the most. So we're going to go with this one. We definitely need to spend some talent points for sure. And... In watching my edits back when I'm editing my own videos, I kind of relook at certain things that I looked that I glossed over or whatever. And I think I want to start spending more time and more technique points with this stuff and fill out these trees. But I don't know. I remember that there was something that I really liked. I think I'm gonna invest in this one. Notice the flashing aura around assassination targets when their allies will be alerted by their death. This will be so helpful, especially for someone like me who is not very good at stealth and who always like 
the main issue also here's a gripe that i do have that i find very interesting okay so hear me out there's this common problem that i come across in this game when i'm specifically trying to do stealth so when you're crouching and walking around in the tall grasses right my first assumption when i try to lure somebody over to the grass or i lose lure somebody over into another set of grass and I sneak over or I wait for them to come to me, but I wait for them to come into the grass where I am. And I assume that when I still take them out that they will remain unseen, even though there might be someone like kind of farther away from us. Because most other games that I've played when you're doing stealth, even if you're like, even if your character's getting up, and they're taking someone out in the stealth grass, they are not noticed generally by anyone else. Like, I think I remember doing that and playing like this in games like The Last of Us, Last of Us Part Two, I think, and like Assassin's Creed, you could take people out in tall grasses and no one would be any wiser. But for this one, even though I'm taking somebody out in the tall grass, I still have to be very aware of who is in the direct vicinity around me because I will still get caught. So that's something I get, I need to get used to. But I think doing this will help with my stealth skills going forward. What is this? Mongo, what? Oh my gosh, so we do have a reason to go back and do these. I'm assuming these are just like re-liberating things that they took over. Get steel, minor legend increase. So I wanted to see if I could go back here and fill out the rest of this map because it is honestly killing me inside that I haven't cleared out all the fog and discovered all of the question mark bits. But what do I want to invest my time in doing today? Out of curiosity's sake, I really just want to see what'll happen and what occurs when you go to one of these icons. And I also just want to get into some trouble. Oh yes, Mongols have definitely been here. Yeah. Alright, here here we go. Here's some stealth attempts. Because I do, I try to keep a lot of the combat advice that I get in the comments, like, in mind, but I hope you guys understand, like, I get so many comments, and I get so many different pieces of advice, and I try to remember all of them, but when you get that much information, it is so hard to remember, because you're also trying to build things off of like what you already normally do but i i hope you guys understand that i'm just gonna at the end of the day just do what the comp what feels right for me in the moment with the combat like what is comfortable for me because there's just so much to do so much going on and i get so much advice it's really hard to implement all of it all the time and you know just to be an expert because I kind of like like making mistakes and learning because that's how you learn. What? Get up there! Get up there! Get up there! Get up there! We're a ghost. We gotta be stealthy. So we got. But I try my best. Oh shush! Oh, how did you not hear that? Oh yeah, Ve victim, victim, victim. No one, no one's here. Oh wait, no, go up there. Yeah. Oh, wait, I can assassinate two at the same time. Don't go anywhere. How did? Wait, why did that not work? Every single time I go to heavy attack them, then they stab me, and I'm like, well... <laughs> That's often why people always ask, like, why I wait, or, like, I don't have to wait to for somebody to attack me to, like, take them out. I can use the heavy attacks to stagger them, and I know this, but whenever I try to do that, that's when they take their advantage to strike me and hurt me and give me damage. So I like to err on the side of caution and patience, and I like to... I don't know, I feel like do the samurai way and just be really really patient and wait for my perfect moment to strike so that I'm more likely to win. All right, let's free this person. You'll be free soon. If a samurai lives, then it must be true Lord Shimura is free. This is a great day, my lord. I prayed for this. Be careful up there. Um, is there anything good up here? 
black powder bombs. This dude is ready for a fight. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. Alright, so who else is left around here? Um, or, but you know what? My favorite way is also the bow. The way of the bow. You just, you can't go wrong attacking from afar. Quite like this. See, yeah, and then look at this! Look at this! That's right, that's right, that's right. I'm gonna take this dude out. Leave the dude alone! Best way to stealth right here! Shit, don't even blow that horn. Oh! Well, okay, that's, that's the way to do it. See, every t I, I wanted to do it, but then he's in the middle of trying to stab me. No. Yeah, I like that. We can do this and then hold it down. Do that. I was in the wrong stance. <laughs> Hurry. Hurry. I'm here. Hold still. Oh, that just reminded me. You saw the sign. I always remember you. Find somewhere safe. Be careful. Just be careful. And I saw the sign. And I opened up my eyes and saw the sign. Alright, this one's for all of you in the comments. This is dedicated to you who've been telling me about this the whole time. And yeah. I'll just get you turned around. Nope, oh, wrong way. First off, I would like to state that I was today years old when I found out that Jin could bow in the game, period. Um, if that was mentioned to me earlier, I have since forgotten it, but um, somebody in the comments were like, you should bow whenever you see these bow signs because something fun happens and I think it also contributes to a trophy, but unless again I missed it because... I, I tend to have, like, a hard time picking up on certain visual cues, but, yeah, that's just me. So you're the hostage, we just saved you. But maybe something happens when I bow up more of them. That's what I'm assuming. But I finally did it! <laughs> I finally noticed those signs, like, I never noticed them before. Um, gotta love the little details, always. I'm going to have to assume that the next hostage is up here. Oh no. Wait. Shh. I'm going to take this dude out. Easy peasy. Yeah. You'll be long dead before you notice me. <laughs> Boom. Done. <laughs> and they're, again, none the wiser. Love it. Need that. Oh wait. Can I grab that? Can I grab that ammo? Yeah. Going back down there. Yep. I really want to try to jump on two people and and you know kill them both at the same time. You know what? Wait, where there is a person out here, where did they go? So so I love that now. Um so, no one is around him, because I did unlock that. Yeah, no one is around him, because he's not glowing more, so no one's going to catch me. Yikes, dude. Yikes, dude. Man, they hide some good stuff under these buildings. Ah, that's mine. Let's go inside, take him out. Oh wait, there's one guy left. We- Nope. Um, ah! This part is still <laughs> very confusing. So, D-pad, weapon. The arrow types, shapes. <laughs> and then this guy's- Ah, oh, crap. No, you didn't see me. No, you didn't see me. Done. That guy- <laughs> There's no help for this guy. Oh, 
he still doesn't see me. Okay, so where is... <gasps> oh, yeah. Okay, that was epic. You're going to be all right. What a relief. Thank you, Lord Sakai. Be careful up there. Be careful out there. Rescue hostages. Got it. Done. So it seems like that's what happens. So we come to these things, we rescue all the hostages, we go about our way. Yeah, look at it now. So peaceful. Photo op. Jin is such a mood right now. <laughs> I had to get a photo of that. That was perfect. Oh man. Okay, so I want to check on the map. Okay, cool. Oh, please be bamboo. Please be bamboo. Please. 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 Oh, if it's not me to cry. I want to do one of those so badly. So I feel like whenever you have question marks inside of a town, it's more likely to be one of those. My oh, it, is it a quest? I speak with you. Yeah. The invaders are gone. It's not that, my lord. A group of bandits is terrorizing Komoda. They slaughtered my whole family like animals. Then I'll hunt them down like animals. Where do they kill your family? At our home, north of here, on the river. I'll pick up the bandit's trail there. What's your name? Saki, my lord. I will avenge your family, Saki. The Laughing Bandits. Well, we gotta do this now. We gotta help the poor lady. Oh, just show up. She tells me her problems, and I'm like, sorry, I don't have the time right now. It just doesn't seem right. Oh, we got a bird, and I think I know where it's gonna take me. This is about to heal my soul. The moment we've all been waiting for. No, but you stay here. You butt blocker, you, you devious bastard. Give me the crack! Mm. Also, to everyone tagging the poor actor for Jin, because I've been gushing about his butt cheeks. He don't need to know that! I do not want to be perceived by that, by that person. It's embarrassing, okay? Sensei Ishikawa, creature comforts. I'm kind of just curious what that means, but I like Sensei. Sensei Ishikawa should visit this place. Yes. I wonder if he's ever relaxed in his life. He's strung tighter than his bowstring. <laughs> oh man, that was funny. I love the subtle digs at each other. Ooh. Hot cakes are right, enough of that. Stop tagging the poor guy, okay? Jeez. Oh, is this it? Yep. Yeah. Must be sucky, so we should check inside. Are there people around here? No? Oh, I thought I heard something. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> Looks like a spy just hmm. tucking and rolling in here. Killed in cold blood. Oh, I did hear noise, but it was all this buzzing. That's gross. A map marking this location. What's it say? And then we can finally be together. Wait, what? This was no random attack. Yeah. This was I a crime of here. passion. I should check outside. Love. Love or obsession. 
Infatuation? Because this is a weird form of love. Died trying to protect his family. <gasps> Wait, where else? We gotta check. The front? Oh my gosh! I was looking for tracks the whole time! A lot of men here. Good for the road. Oh my god, I ran around this house, I think, over 50 times now, trying to find something. And, because I would just, I would go just off the path and then I would have to come back to the house. I just, I was looking in the wrong direction. Follow the bandit tracks. Oh, there they are. That's a lot of people. Oh, me, my lord. That's a lot more tracks for just one one guy. What happened here? I heard the old Ketchy farm was freed. Thought I'd bring them horses and medicine. Bunch of bandits found me first. Yep. Took everything. Any idea where they were headed? They mentioned Komoda village. Whatever's left of it. I'll head there. Can you walk? Ketchy isn't far. I think so. Find those bastards. They thought this was funny. That was cruel. They just knocked out his knee and then left him alone. And then his poor horse. What the Oh, they probably took out his horse and then like he flew off. That's messed up. Come to the village. The bandits could be here. Ooh. I'm banking on it. I am banking on it. Do I wanna do a standoff? I kinda wanna go in stealthy. Wait, I need this. They are actually laughing. What did she do when he threw her out? Imagine you killed your whole family to be with the man you love. A few days later, he gets rid of you. What would you do? Probably kill myself. Oh, so that's what happened. I really just want to get on this. Wait, can't I grapple up there now? There should be a way to grapple, shouldn't there? Oh no, they moved. There they go. There they go. I can get up here. Wait, so I want to distract them. Let's come here, guys. Come here, guys. Ding ding. Yeah, yeah, come here. Come here. Come here. No one can see him, right? We're about to find out. Oh, goodness. Okay. So they're on to me. They're on to me. I parry! Boo! Want this guy. There we go. Anyone else? No one else. No. Oh, there you are. Come here! Ooh, that was close. He almost hit me. Boom. Alright, this is for everyone else in the comments. This is for you, dedicated, telling me this for a while. Okay, he just wiped off his bloody katana on his nice white shirt. What about your nice white shirt? This is why we can have nice things. That stain's never coming out. But that was dedicated to you. Finally! I have seen a lot of those comments on several videos. Apparently that moment meant a lot to a lot of people. So I hope that that was everything that you imagined. And more. Okay. I 
a second. Is he gonna be seen? I guess it doesn't matter because they won't see me. I know it's him. Oh no! What? What? Oh, what did you say? Don't go anywhere. There you go. Ooh. Um. What can I do? Oh, we got the smoke bombs, the kunai, but then. He's backing up right into me. <laughs> Archer, get into cover. Oh crap, I missed. Nope. No, you didn't see me. It's nothing. Yeah, right, it's nothing. Yeah, keep telling yourself that. He has arrows. Enemy Archer! Just you just need to like give up now, bud. Give up now, buddy boy. Must have run off. Nope. Mm, right no, here. I'm so close, I can smell ya. Nice. Okay. Um. Oh, right. So we were we were here to talk to somebody. Hope it wasn't the person that got stabbed. Wait, no, no, no. We're going in the door, front door. Hello. My lord, will you let me go? Of course. If you tell me the truth, what were these men laughing at? Some poor girl. She was in love with Haruo. He was in charge. She told him where her family hid their rice. Was her name Saki? Yes, Saki. <gasps> she thought Haruo would return her affection. Instead, he killed her family, took the rice, and left her in the ditch. And I was the instrument of her revenge. Get out of here! Was it worth it? Sucky. Just cast her off to the side, killed her family? Oh my god. And some people wonder why other people got trust issues. Yeah, that's- you add that to the list. <laughs> mm. No, thank you. Saki, you definitely have a lot of explaining to do. We're getting new side quests again. What's going on here? The spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance has returned, my lord. It's been killing people in the old ruins. I haven't heard of this spirit. You're sure this isn't the Mongols doing? You don't know the legend of Lord Yarikawa's final curse? The musician Yamato tells it better than anyone. He's near old Yarikawa now. I'll look for him. Get to the bottom oh, of this. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's another mythic, isn't it? Yes. Oh, my gosh. Hold for details. Map updated. Oh, my gosh, yes. Wait. Oh, that's north. That's in the northern part. Hell, yeah. Those are... I feel like you should definitely prioritize doing these missions first because of the awesome stuff that you get. And look at the sword kit that we get. And then you get another reward called the Dance of Wrath, which I can only imagine being super cool. So I'm probably gonna do that it's pretty a soon. Tragedy, my lord. Where is Saki? She drowned herself. <gasps> From what I understand, she blamed herself for the death of her family. She was manipulated by the bandits you met on the road. They won't do any more harm. Thank you, my lord. Perhaps some good will come of this. That is so sad. That is so sad. I was hoping we could come back and like help make it better somehow. Saki, no! Charm of bludgeoning? Okay, I gotta check this out. Moderate increase to stagger damage. Mmm. Might have to to switch to that one, but I don't want to switch that one. I want to do... I'm going to do this one. New gift is available. I know exactly where I'm going. Got another bird. This bird always shows up here, though. Collect. Gifted. Trophy earned. Wait, I, I wonder if it's, um, like you get so many gifts. However many gifts. Oh, yeah. Yes, those bastards. I can't 
can't upgrade my sword. You can, however, upgrade the armor. I want to see what arm. <gasps> wait, 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 wait. Hold on. I want to see what I can upgrade armor-wise. I work on all kinds of armor. Hmm. Tadayori's armor, samurai clan armor. Eee, reduce enemy detection speed by 20%. Major increase to melee damage. I think... Ah, oh, but I do love yeah, using the fix. bow. I'm gonna go see what the upgrades are for the bow really quick. There is no substitute for a great bow. Half bow, long bow. <gasps> oh, wait. Oh my gosh, yes. We're gonna do, I'm gonna fully upgrade the half bow. So then that's done. That's bow nice. Without equal. I don't have to worry about that anymore. That's beautiful. You and then the required materials. Two more of these. Very yes. sorry. It's okay, you don't have to be sorry. I'm, I'm poor, it's fine, that's normal. All right, what to do next? The bow will terrify the invaders. The bow terrifies me, or rather my lack of skill with the bow terrifies me. All right. Armor will dull the Mongols' weapons. Hey, I'll do it. Tadayori's armor, so it'll increase knocking and reload speed, which yes, please. And then total cons or 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 or. Hear me out. Maybe I'll just save up until I can upgrade Ronin attire three because I do like that armor. I I do think I would use it a lot. It's probably one of my top favorite armors behind the Traveler's armor right now in terms of like combat specific i really like that uh, you need more to make these improvements Ooh, i was also today years old when i learned that you could change the armor appearance so what does that do it just takes off the like shoulder panels that's really cool that you can do that i don't know i i do kind of like the look of the arm and wrist armor i think i'm gonna keep it Yes, my favorite! Cool, I was just out and about exploring and I wanted to discover more of the question marks. And I'm glad I did. Yeah, baby. Hey, that one's kind of hard because my thumb's got to... My thumb's got to do some work now. Oh no! Oh, I missed the very last one and it was because i wasn't fast enough no i keep faltering it it's my it's my right thumb ah i didn't press triangle at the very end got it got it i knew it i felt that one deep in my soul i was like that's the one that's the one need two more of those oh my god those are my favorite. I say that every time. Like, don't we know this? All right, can I slide in through here? Well, you know, let's let's be civilized here and go through the front door. Crap! 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 Crapola! Shut! Shut up! Boom. Okay. Don't think that I didn't notice that it went right through the tree. Can I shoot them through these massive gaps in the the fence? Like, I would hope so. Okay, well, we're not going in through the front door. Where is there an opening? There it is. Tell us where the others are. I told you. I'm traveling alone. If you want to live, you'll stop lying. There's no one else. <gasps> you know what? I'm going to switch to my Ronin gear. I don't know if I'm going to... Oh! Never mind. I was going to say, I don't know if I was going to get that. You know what? No, let's go in through the other side. I feel like he's going to be able to see me. Silently. Silent. No need to be scared of me. I'm here to save you. I don't think he'll be able to see me. Yeah, he saw me. Think I heard someone. 
Once again, easy. Done. I really... I really want to try to jump on two people. And kill them both. <gasps> yes! Okay, so I pressed the wrong button. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Finally successful. So are we good now? We good now? Oh, we're not good now. We're not good now. I did not see that guy. Ooh, now we're good. Got him. Ooh, look at that. Point. Ready? Watch. That's not it. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh, he didn't wipe it. He's too good for that now. It's because I yelled at him before, isn't it? Is that it? Is that all we need to do for this camp here? Oh, you can also swipe right to, like, unsheathe it. Ah. I wasn't sure. I did not know that the, that the pad had any other uses besides, like, the guiding wind and, like, I, well, maybe one other thing. Hello. There's screams. You have to do something, my lord. What screams? What happened? First, I heard the Mongol drums, chanting. But when I ran to look, all I saw were our people, driven mad, screaming like they were trapped in some kind of nightmare. Maybe a new Mongol trick. Where was this? A small settlement in Akashima, near Drowned Man's Shore. I'll check on them. Be careful, my lord. Oh, gosh. A lot of screams today. Ghosts. More murder. Oh. oh, man. Ooh, and I just got something new. It's called Tales of Iki are now available. That must be what that other guy gave me. <gasps> right? So there's more? So we got the mythic tales, we got these tales, we got normal side missions, and then we got main missions. Now this game ended up being a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. I mean, to be fair, I knew it was going to be large because it's an open world game. I heard the story was pretty in-depth, but I didn't quite understand that this was the scale of it. You know what I mean? Alright, anyway, I'm excited to do these. Alright, I'm back at Fort Ito, and there's a question mark. I want to find out what it is. Hopefully it's another bamboo. But I want to continue into the next area. I want to see more. I did a lot of exploring in the southern part of the map again. I just want to check out some new things. But, and I also want to eventually, like, clear out all the fog on that map. But I, I definitely want to proceed and see what happens. So where is it? Oh, there it is. Yes! It looks exact. Oh, yes, it looks like what I think it is. Act two. Ooh, that's official. Hell yeah, what better way to go into act two? Oh, easy? Too easy. There we go. Ooh. I did it! Let's go. I need one more to increase my resolve. Wonder how big the resolve gauge can get. All right. Zuhara is under attack. So there is <gasps> Oh my gosh. Kotun Khan is striking back by sending Mongol forces to raid the farmsteads of Izuhara. Liberate the farmsteads to free your people. That is so overwhelming and not even funny. Let's do this. So when I did go back, I went back south and I picked up another one of these mission things. And apparently they're new too. So what are they called? They're called Tales of Iki. And that's the first one that I picked up. So kind of want to just see what those are. And then I want to keep going with some of the character tales, specifically Ishikawa's tale, because I really want to know what happens with Tomoe and all that, so... Ooh, I, I, at least I know where we're gonna start. Let's start with this one. Ooh, 
do we want to get into trouble? Do we not? Do we want? I I think we want to. Yeah. Let's do it. Standoff. Mongol eagles. That's new. The Mongols have an eye in the sky. If their eagle sees you, it will alert nearby enemies. Okay. Great. Cool. I'm ready. Woo! That was new too. Never done that before. Wait, is the eagle gonna like also try to kill me? So now I gotta worry about these dive bombers too? Or are they just gonna call out where I am? Oh no! Boom, sit still. There we go. Dead? Okay, eagle. You got no one. You got no one to go to now. You're free. Oh, it just, just dive bomb the water. That's fine. What is this over here? Is this a person? That's a person. Oh, no. He couldn't handle it. What the hell? Well, that's a sight to see. I think we can all agree. Ooh, fox. Fox den over there. Let's go get it. Yeah, this area definitely looks very scary, lonely, desolate. Kinda creepy. Could believe that this area is haunted. Oh, so oh god! Oh, good lord. Boop, in the butt. Got it. Dead. Oh, well, hold on, Fox, wait for me, please. Oh no, it got away! That's what I get for shooting it in the butt. The shrine over here, where is it? Oh, I see it. It's in there. It's in there. That was a lot of flowers. So I think I upgraded to the maximum amount of charm slots. Oh, but now, if I find more of these, now I just get new charms, which, cool. All right. Where's the fox? No pets? No, oh no, the pets. Of course. <laughs> you guys so excited. This is so cute. These foxes literally remind me of my Toby. It's not even funny. Okay, maybe they jump a little bit higher because he is the laziest Jack Russell you will ever meet. And every Google article ever was like, they have the highest energy levels you will ever see. I'm like, my dog needs waking up and an alarm clock more than I do. Um, so I don't know what any of you dog experts are talking about because Toby defies all logic. But, ooh, cool. Hey! Oh! No sign of any other monks, though. What? I don't know, bird? Bamboo? Come on, come on, give me the bamboo. I also love them, too, because they get you more health. Like, who, who wouldn't want more health? Oh, what is it? I'll take bamboo or butt cheeks. One of the two. Just Is it in this abandoned house? This super creepy abandoned house. Oh, we got records. Oh, I love how overgrown this house looks. How cool is that? Or is it trying to get to the other side of the house? That's also plausible. Maybe it didn't realize it could go around. Okay, now flowers are not hard to come by at all. Just find the blue ones. Okay, so the bird did purposefully take me here. Oh, I was gonna say, that looks significant, but it's because I can grapple. Wait a second. 
Wait, does something special and cool happen if I climb it all the way to the top? Wait, can we get up to the very, very top? Is there anything really cool at the, the top roof? I don't see anything. But there is a, oh, there is a different way inside this house up here. Oh, cool. Oh, I got a new headband, okay. Cherished by the healers of Akashima. Oh, that's a cool looking one too. L another white headband that'll go with like virtually all of my other outfits. <laughs> but I kind of want to wear this one. I think I want to change it up a little bit because this one kind of goes even better with this outfit if I can say so. All right, where to next? Let's check the map because I know I was on my way. How far is this? Oh, we're not that far from it. Oh, I love the stones and the these beautiful flowers that are just everywhere. Wow. Investigate the settlement. Oh, we're here. Yeah, already don't like the sound of that. What's happening here? What's with all the purple? Air okay, we got arrows. Investigate the settlement. What the heck happened? I can help. What's wrong? The water! It was so shadow! I was on the gun a moment! That's over now. You're here with me. Their minds are lost in a thousand hells. Who did this? Oh, so there's n there's new collectibles called the Records of Iki. So, to be read in Japanese to captives on Tsushima. Anksar Kat Katan... Anksar Kat Katan, I hope I pronounced that right. The eagle of the great Mongol nation, ruler of the blessed eagle tribe, sends warm greetings to the people of Tsushima. To cross an ocean, we make ships and rudders. To rule a people, we invite sage men and women to join us in keeping good order. You who love wisdom, join us. You who are eager to birth mysteries, to be free of suffering, warm yourselves at our hearth fires. But refuse our peaceful offer, and we will reveal your inner darkness. Then you will weep and cry out for the golden light of the eternal blue sky, but it will be too late for you. These are the words of the eagle. They can send people into madness at will. That's... That's scary, no thank you. But it looks like there's still more to to look for. Can I talk to anyone else? I think I gotta go search the little building with like the purple. Yeah, there it is. Or up there. Those signs look odd Mongo too. Yurt. This color. Yeah. I don't recognize the tribe. I love the color though. That was the first thing that my eyes noticed. Some kind of restraint on her. She bit her tongue off. Blood to death. What did these people endure? Oh, the horror. Wait, there's a boat. Okay, but it's not. It's not significant. Bongle presence. There's this thing. What is that? Oh! Looks like an altar. For some kind of Mongol ceremony. Samurai! That's not my name! The eagle calls to you! Um, cool. Shamans. Shamans enter a chanting trance to stir the spirits of their allies, allowing them to attack relentlessly. I was sitting here wondering, watching that, if there was some sort of 
supernatural element to this game like at all and there, and there is i love that there are like little hints of spirituality and supernatural stuff but ooh. He's chanting filling them with bloodlust uh, okay uh, so what does that mean then for me is this bad news ah! holy sh okay i'm gonna maybe have to wait for a parry because i don't know what else to do Holy smokes! The warriors search at that shaman's call. Oh, so maybe I have to kill the shaman then. That's the only thing that would make sense right now, because these guys are murdering me. We need to get we need to get rid of you, bud. Boom. What? Does he not take damage? Do I have to go up there and actually kill him myself? There we go. Okay, yep, that's it. So go for the shaman first. Oh, nice. He's got a spear. Typhoon kick! No! You stop it. More of them. That's horrifying. There you are. Crazy though that you can't actually You can't actually hit them like you You have to go up there and fight them melee. They will deflect arrows. That's crazy. Oh, there you are. Uh-uh. Get him. Get him. Nice. Oh, man. Alright, yeah. Take out your buddies. Right in the face. No, there was one guy left. You won't torment no. anyone else. Nope. I need to find out who these invaders are. Okay. Who are you? Tell me what you did to these people. They heard the call of the eagle. The eagle? Is he your leader? She will lead the eagle tribe to your shores. With all mm. of Tiki Island at her back. Okay, we'll bring it on. They came from Iki Island. What? What is happening? Jin. Help me. I came as soon as I heard those people. They're getting the help they need. But I don't know if they will recover. What happened to them? I'm not sure. I haven't seen these Mongols before. They claim to follow someone called the Eagle. And they're planning an attack on Tsushima. Those people lost their minds. If the Eagle can do that to the whole island... She won't. How will you find her? One of her people mentioned Iki Island. It's full of raiders and criminals. They hate the samurai. I know. My father led the campaign to pacify them, and he... He died on that island. The samurai retreated after he fell. Now something monstrous has taken root on Iki Island. 
I have to go back. Huh. I wonder if this is DLC content. Oh, I bet you that's what it is. That makes so much more sense now. I was like, that was not what I was expecting to come from that quest line whatsoever. I wasn't expecting a whole narrative thing in a flashback back to watching his father die. That was such a shock. So that'll be fun. I wonder how long that whole side story will take. Yes, yes, I will do it. The boat's ready. Oh, yeah, so maybe this will be a whole other thing for a whole other time, but now I know that was fun. That's cool that they added the whole shaman thing with, like, supernatural spiritual stuff. People losing their minds. Actual, like, spirit shields and stuff. The refugee camp. Sensei Ishikawa said he'd meet me here. Hell yeah, he did. That's why I'm here. I ha I've been waiting for this moment for a while. Been excited to jump back into his tail. He is not here. No. Maybe someone has seen him. I still can't believe how fast the Mongols took over. Was the bird just taking I me here? Would you like to see what I have? I mean, I guess. I have so many flowers this now, is an so. Interesting find. Very recent. Yes. <gasps> oh. How freaking cool is that? We have some good ones. Ooh, I love that one. I love the contrast. It looks like the green with the white. I have to buy that one. I think one. you'll be pleased. I love that one. I, I just, I love that one the best. Like, I don't even need the other two. What kind of hats do we have? Okay, so kind of the same stuff. Armor dies, we just check that. Bow vanity gear. Do I own... Ooh, I kind of like this. I'm just going to buy it Whatever to have it. helps you is good for us all. Oh, this will be perfect. This will be perfect for any of, like, my ghostly outfits, honestly. I I kind of love both. If but you can I, bring more, it's yours. I kind of like this one a little bit better. Emperor's Tears. It looks so cool. You know... You have do I want to keep the fluffy? Do I want to keep the fluffy one? You know, I have been using it for a while. I think it's time to change it up. Emperor's Tears. We're going to switch it to this one for a little bit. Just enjoy some new designs. It looks so slick. So, Ishikawa is not here. But there are some other people to talk to. It looks like there's a side quest. What did you find? Mongols. You're our own have you heard, my lord? Mongols. Searching for something powerful. Something our people have been hiding for years. What? The Mongols want it. They believe it can help them in their fight. The story says the armor can turn even a simple farmer into a warrior. I wonder what it could do for oh. a samurai. I'm no storyteller, my lord. But the musician Yamato tells it well. Another that one! Way, he was near Akashima. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, so we got... One, we got um, the location of one of them. And wait, bring it out, bring it out, bring it out. <gasps> oh, we have the location of two. That's huge. And I thought the other map was huge. We have two that we can do. Oh my gosh, and this one's really close. Maybe we can try to do as much of Ishikawa's tale as we can. And then maybe we'll end it with a mythic tale. Because these are so fun. And what's this one going to... It's going to get me Gosaku's armor. And then this one's going to get me Dance of Wrath and a new sword kit. And I love the sword kits. And that one looks really cool. It's very colorful. Can't wait to see what that one looks like. So much to do, though. I mean, I love that we have so many options. All right, but let's go find Ishikawa. <laughs> Ow, sorry. Yikes. I'm looking for a samurai, an archer. The sensei headed toward the coast. He said you should catch up with him to join the hunt. And you'd know what that meant. <laughs> he knows me so well. Dreams of conquest. All right. Where, where did he go? Paul Nobu. 
Oh, I do not like that sound. Since Ishikawa is in trouble. Oh, I see that. Oh, we got bombs. Boop. Catch. Okay, these guys can shoot really, really, really fast. But I can shoot faster. Okay, well, if I had arrows. <laughs> I don't have arrows. Wait, but I might have normal fire arrows. You set people on fire, right? Boom. There you are. Wait, wait, wait. Somebody else. Uh -huh. Oh! Yeah, these people can fire so fast. Keep your head down. Here you are. Arrow, thank you. Oh my gosh. You're wounded. I'll survive. You should have waited for me at the camp. I had a lead on Tomoe. I couldn't risk losing her. Were those her archers? I ha they'd have Show to be. Name. They'd have to be. More on the way. They were so good. Wound. I'll take them. Yup. Yup. Wow. Oh, nice. Oh, you bum. Oh, so they shoot two. Oh, no, that guy shot three. Oh, that was close. He could have shot me a third time. Oh, no, you do not. Nope, you first. Boy. Are you good? Is everyone dead? Speak with Ichikawa, yes. Not bad, Sakai. Thank you. <sighs> they had you surrounded. Tomoe taught them well. Too well. That's not why they outmaneuvered you. You call them old. You have an insight. Share it. You didn't notice them, because you were too focused on finding Tomoe. Oh, what? Even I make mistakes, Sakai. No, you don't. Except with her. <gasps> what is he? What is he insinuating? What? That's a twist. Plot twist. Were they a thing? Were they an item? I, I thought he was about to call him out for being, like, a little bit older. I was like, that's rude. You're bringing age into it. Butchers, for the most part. Tomoe has been seen with them on raids all over Kashima. She won their trust. She's a useful tool to divide and conquer, for now. Tomoe betrayed you before she sided with the Mongols. But you never told me exactly what happened. She used my teaching to help a band of assassins. They paid well. It still doesn't explain why she attacked you. Sakai, how does a samurai deal with an assassin? You retaliated and attacked her. And I dealt with Tomoe as I would any common murderer. She was your student. I don't make exceptions, Sakai. First, Hironori Nagawa. Now, Tomoe. Don't be the next to disappoint me. Don't be the next. Ooh. Ooh, okay. What's. What's that, though? What is this? Hey, 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 hey. Uh, Sensei? 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 C do you mind? Sakai, this way. No! He will get mad. I want to go see what that is. Alright, fine. What's that ahead? They hunt people for sport. Not sport. Practice. They're ruthless. Indulging violence weakens the warrior. Like too much food or drink. Well, I was, I was gonna say maybe practice would be worse than sport, but I think when you do a sport, there's an element of fun to the game. 
You said that could be worse. Traveled to your dojo to study. What did she do before that? Her mother belonged to a merchant family in Unugi. She never knew her father. Why do you ask? Killing is not learned overnight, even for a prodigy with a bow. She was born with a taste for bloodshed. That's a cool. I can't. Oh, that looks. <gasps> More of Tomoe's work. Okay. Not yellow trees, not red trees. I think this is the first time we've really seen like bright orange trees with that sunset. I gotta take a photo. Sensei. Their archers hunt the people of Akashima like dogs. Tomoe and her allies are too hungry for violence. A killer masters a weapon. A samurai masters himself. You've devoted your life to mastering the bow. To the bow, yes. Not to killing. Now you're splitting hairs. I've tied a wounded man to my horse with a bowstring. He used an arrowhead to cut meat when I had no knife. You're saying a bow is more than a weapon. And a samurai is more than a killer. True. That is a gorgeous shot. It's always the sunlight that does it, though. It's the shadows. We can't win back. We have no choice. We have to kill her. I trained her. I share the blame for her actions. I will end this. You only share the blame if you encouraged her thirst for violence. I made her my student. I should have seen the darkness in her. You didn't see it, and that scares you. Uh, it bothers me. <laughs> it's like, a oh, don't be mistaken. I'm not scared. We're nearly there. We'll approach this like Fort Nakayama. Observe the camp. Look for weaknesses. Make a plan of attack. That's right, Sakai. Look twice and shoot once. Look twice, shoot once. We will go on foot from here. This place is really pretty. Ooh, there's a smokestack over there. There's got to be someone over there. I hear them. Ah, there they are. Yup. Okay, what do we do? Definitely a camp for training archers. Hmm. <gasps> oh my god, how horrible. Survey Tomoe's camp. Mongolian-style archery. A hybrid. Tomoe is teaching them. Training to fight samurai. We will give them more to learn. We take the camp, <laughs> then find out where she is. The moment you attack, my arrows will strike home. All right, reach the encounter area. Um, should I get? Uh, I feel like I need to get there before I start attacking. So, I'm gonna use some willpower here. It's taking a lot. No, 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 do not perceive me, please, no. Defeat the. Oh. Oh, oh shoot! They can see me. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna chill here. I wonder how far away I can throw a bomb. They can't see me. <laughs> oh, easy. No, you're kidding me. You're kidding. Nice. Okay. I think I might have just had an epiphany. Hopefully I can remember it. Stab, stab, yeah! Okay, I think I'm getting it. Ow, no, well, it has nothing to do with that. Ah. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Don't copy me, that's my move. That's right. Yep, I think I had an epiphany with the combat. So, like... 
For me, it really works if I kind of wait for them to attack. So then they attack me, I parry, it staggers them, and then I hold down the heavy attack, lay that on them, and either break their stance or just injure them. And then I can go in, quick attack, finish them off. That's, that's what I find now that that's like my go-to combat style for this. But like trying to use all of the elements in the combat in one fight, if that makes sense. I find that really, really fun. And I was really able to experiment there. I want more people to fight! Yes! Boop. Okay, well, ignore that. Ignore that. Yeah, thank you, Ishikawa! <laughs> you sent it an arrow out of nowhere. <laughs> Oh Let's make God. sure. Look around. Woo! Okay. Oh, arrows. Return to the training. Okay. Got some scrolls. Supply list. Japanese bows and targets. Delivery locations all over Toyotama. She's setting up more training camps. One in Otsuna, another in Kushi. And more planned. Mm. Lovely. It's no bueno. Okay. And is there more around here? I don't know if we gotta go past this way. Ah! Okay. A message in Japanese. What does it say? Great Khan, conqueror of Tsushima. <gasps> Before the year is over, your archers will know all I do about killing samurai. And I will deliver the heads of Sensei Ishikawa and Jin Sakai. Tomoe was here. No, so, yeah. I gave her everything. And she threw it away. She's a threat. There is only one way this ends. I know what must be done. Knowing and doing are different. You are questioning whether I am samurai? Don't worry. It was my greatest achievement. But if I must, I will destroy her to save this island. I'm right here. That is my duty. The list we found. We will use it to track down the other camps. And we will end Tomoe's treachery. Sakai! You are a fine warrior. Thank you. You could become a great leader. But do not question my integrity again. <laughs> if looks could kill, man. If looks could kill. That was the moment that they realized that there was no turning her back and changing her mind. That was a powerful moment. I want to do the next one though. I want to do the next one. Charm of precision. Ooh, I might need that. Moderate increase to arrow damage. Okay. Do we have any more Ishikawa? Yes, the ghost and the demon sensei. Oh, that's what they call him. So I'm the ghost and he's the demon. <laughs> um. Since Ishikawa's former student, Tomoe has plans to erect Mongol archery training camps across Toyotama. One is in Kushi, and then there is a small settlement just over the Yarikawa border where I can begin to begin the hunt. We're, we're doing it. All right, Sensei, I will meet you there. <laughs> What's going on? <gasps> be the spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance. Tread carefully, my lord. Oh, I will. Oh. Is a dangerous place. I do want to save this for its own episode. Maybe. Maybe I'll see if I can do it after this next Ishikawa tale. Because, man, I would love to do that. But I kind of want to do it in a separate episode. We'll see. Yeah, this looks not friendly. Yeah, definitely not friendly. Alright, so what are we going to do here? So there's this guy. I think I want to take him out from back here. Not worry about him. Ooh, 
there we go. They didn't even notice. Yeah, they noticed. Aw, oh, shoot. They seem to have really good eyesight. <laughs> I mean, okay, never mind then, I guess. Alright, these archers need to go bye-bye. Ow. Wow! Okay, this new section of the map definitely brought new challenges, too. Okay, I think I want to approach this a little bit different. There's no stealth grass around here. Um, maybe I can do a throwable instead and take more of them out. Yeah, they don't see me. No, 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 no. There's no way. There's no way! You don't see me! Yeah, that's right. Grab it. Boom. Alright, we're going in. See, I went into attack first, but he- they almost always try to get the attack first. Yeah. There it is. Yeah. Oh man, the arrows, the arrow switching, or the bow switching still gets me. We're going back in. Okay, don't kick me while I'm down. That's just rude. Is it even worth trying to get back up? These guys are hard. This is- what is this? Uh, okay, well, I learned a very, very, very tough lesson just now. And it is that when they say overwhelming enemy forces, they mean overwhelming enemy forces where you will die a lot if you are not prepared. And I was not prepared. We are going to skip that for now and see if there is another way to get around. <laughs> Ooh, hey! There's a bird taking me. And here I was thinking that that was where we had to meet Sensei the whole time. Where is this bird taking me? Where'd it go? Oh, okay. This is... So I just realized where we were. Oh! Oh, a black dye merchant. Black dye merchant? Oh, I've only come across a white dye merchant. Hey! Thief. Thief. Looks like you attacked the wrong caravan. Stay still. I can end your suffering. No, my lord. <gasps> I killed these bandits. And I won't stop till I've gutted the rest. Aren't you one of them? Not by choice. They forced me to join. Said it would pay my family's debt. After years working for them, I went home and saw they killed my family. Stolen all they had. I refuse to die until I've killed every last one. Those bandits have earned death, but you can't do it alone. I would welcome your help. <laughs> my name is Gumio. Jin Gumio. Sakai. Show me where the others are. Ooh, a debt repaid. You're about to start a new tale. Are you sure we want to proceed? No, 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 no. Save for later. Sweet. Wait. Will he show up on the on the map? Yes, he will. Thank goodness. All right. I can't wait to see what that entails. I like that character already. I feel like he's what got a story to tell. Here. All right, we're almost there. Don't kill me! Hey, hey, hey! Take whatever you want. I mean, I will anyway, but I'm not a real ghost. You can, you can, you can't see right through me. Well, you you can see right through me, but <laughs> I'll take this. Though he said I could take whatever I wanted, so I'm just just doing what he said. And then is Ishikawa still not here? I'll give you anything you want. Alright. No, no, no. That's mine. I see it. I see it. Alright, I have taken everything that I want. I'm 
not a thief. Everyone knows you're attacking caravans. The ghost and the demon Sensei. Sensei Ishikawa? That's a lie. I've heard you myself. You heard us? When? Not long ago. Tearing up the road like starving wolves. That wasn't us. The ghost and the demon Sensei. How are Sensei Ishikawa and I being blamed for highway robbery? Head north. Find out who's responsible. My money's on Tomoe. Faster, no. Sensei! Woo! Boom! Got him. Oh no 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 you don't. <laughs> About time you showed up. You're welcome, Sensei. Why does he always beat me everywhere? Ooh, I need that. Yeah, her archers mean business. They are so difficult. Here I was again getting kinda comfortable with the combat, thinking I was getting good. <laughs> and then these people come along to humble me. You're the ghost. Yes. Yes, yes I am. What happened here? His caravan was ambushed. Lots of attacks lately. People say you're stealing supplies. Or sided with the Mongols. Rest easy. I'll discuss this with Lord Sakai. Someone's spreading rumors. Tomoe is behind this. She sows paranoia and fear. Attacking caravans, blaming us. I caught up to his group too late. Saved him, but not the others. Where was he ambushed? Close. Why? Find the ambush site. Track the rest of Tomoe's group to their camp. That makes sense. What's wrong? Nothing. She has me off balance. We'll put an end to that. Rest here. Ha ha ha. Eat the food I gave you. And wait a while before you leave. Thank you, Sensei. Show me where he was ambushed. Oh, sounds like they're weed whacking like right outside my window. I'm pretty sure they are. How did you find me? I picked a great Someone day. I heard a convoy being chased. Oh. People avoid the roads because of Tomoe. When I caught wind of a merchant chancing a supply run, I followed. What is Tomoe's goal? Hmm. Why would Tomoe attack supply runs in Kushi Prefecture? There's no strategic importance. No. But Kushidera Temple inspires people. It would be a Mongo effort to break morale here. You don't sound convinced. I think that's part of it. Not all. Tomoe betrayed everything I taught her. Then she betrayed me. And after me, her home. I'll hunt her past the horizon if I must. There's the convoy. And more victims of Tomoe. I can't believe how thick these bamboo forests are. I'm assuming that's, just, that's what these are, but... Let's see wow. what we can learn. How cool. Oh, I thought this person was alive. Nope. That was wrong. It's a warning to the people of Kushi. From Tomoe. From Lord Sakai and Sensei Ishikawa. No travel is permitted on these roads. On pain of death. Crude, but effective. Dang. Okay. They took off down the road. And we'll find them. Oh, there's more. No other survivors. Japanese and Mongo arrows? Of course. This is the last time Tomoe and her men will ambush anyone in Kushi Prefecture. Come. He's out for blood. He's gonna end her. Nobu, come! Nobu! Where are you? There you are. Ooh. Hurry! 
The random moaning and screaming is so creepy. Quickly. There's no time to scout the camp. Now he's rushing in with his Hakama half tied. Ha! <laughs> oh man. Why is she here alone? I'll cut her loose. Please, help. Okay, yeah. Hold still. No, please. Oh no. no. We're here to help. She said. Yeah. She said. Tomo, don't listen to her. What did she say? She said I could live until the samurai came. Oh <gasps> no! 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 Something didn't feel right about that. Something did not feel right about that. Here I am going into full ass panic mode. Oh Jesus. Okay. Yikes. Oh, I'm panicking. I'm panicking. No. You stop it right now. Nice GG's. Yeah, that's right. Okay, one of them's down. Yeah. There we go, another one. So many of them. Ah. Uh, you shot me first. No, you don't. <laughs> okay. Sakai. I knew it. Something did not feel right about that. That is so sad. Yeah, we're not the ones to be feared. She's just evil. Evil. Tomoe set a trap for us, and we walked right into it. I spoke with her two days ago. Tomoe? The captive. Oh. We were talking about a Japanese woman she saw with the Mongols. I asked her to find out where they were camped and report back. You did what? <laughs> it could have gone the other way. We'd be standing over Tomoe's body instead. You talk about what it means to be a warrior. How Tomoe undermines that. But you and she are the same. You expect us to be perfect. Your uncle, me, Masako Adachi. But only a child expects perfection of his elders. So true! Finish your thought, Sensei. We all carry weapons. We all choose between life and death. And you're too comfortable with that power. And if I weren't, I would be dead. And so would you, Ghost. Ghost. Not everyone can be a samurai. But we're all killers. We still have a camp in Otsuna to deal with. That's it? Oh, that was so good. He is so wise. I love him because he is kind of harsh and crass and really rough around the edges. And it was funny, cool, because I also I saw a comment about this. So I really like Ishikawa, but apparently... For, like, a lot of YouTubers and just people in general, you either love him or you hate him. You either kind of see him as, like, a jerk, kind of an a-hole. But I love, like, this darker side, and I love his sarcasm, and I love the rawness of his character. Like, that he's made mistakes, and he's kind of reconciled, or he's trying to reconcile them. But he's he just called him out for believing that all of your elders are supposed to be perfect and that's actually a great life lesson in general and that's something that i as i've been getting older i recognized this a, a long time ago like i remember the moment where that idea kind of dawned on me that you like my parents my elders my teachers the people that are my seniors you know they are not perfect human beings they all make mistakes and i remember the moment that that dawned on me and that i was like i can't always rely on other people to help me or to be there when I need them or to even know the right answer in a certain situation. That was such a powerful, liberating, and also very, like, strong realization to have. I feel like it created a lot of, like, inner strength and individuality, knowing that 
there were a lot of things in life that I was going to have to learn myself. And I love that he hit that home by saying like, you can't expect your teachers, your senseis, and your elders to be perfect. We're all humans at the end of the day. And just love how he got that point across. That is absolutely why I love Sensei Ishikawa's character. But I do have to apologize to you guys. I really, really am sorry about this episode. And if I'm, I don't know where I'm ending. I don't know how long it's going to be right now. But because of the landscaping that is going on outside, I do not want to potentially subject you guys any more to this weed whacking that is happening. As much as I want to proceed with all of the stories and all the new exploration that we can do, I find what's going on outside like really distracting for me and in order to make these videos the best that they can be, I'm gonna wait for a day that there's not a bunch of noise going on outside. So I hope you guys can find it in your hearts to forgive me. I do apologize for this very human moment. <laughs> and speaking of human moments, I did really appreciate the very human and real moment that we just had with Sensei. Next time, I do hope to focus a little bit more on the character quest lines, the mythic tales, and I think I remember coming across this time these new Tales of Iki, but that is for what I think is a DLC quest line. But like I said before, this game needs to just keep giving me the content, anything that'll keep me playing this for as long as I can, because it's just so fabulous. But along with the quests for next time, I don't generally keep a very strict plan of what I want to do, though, because I find that the spontaneity and the coming across random things throughout the game is honestly the best part and it creates some of the best highlights in these games so i love just playing this game and not really having anything specific to look forward to just letting the game tell me what it wants me to experience i really hope you guys enjoyed this episode if you did and if you're looking forward to the next one make sure to leave a thumbs up on this video subscribe to the channel and click that bell button to get notified for all future videos also while you're here make sure to check out all the links down below in the description hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day and i'll see you in the next video